So what's the difference between a convertible car seat and a 360 rotating car seat? And how do you know what's best for you? So before we do anything else, let's talk about the difference between an infant car seat and convertible car seat. Infant car seats are designed for infants, small babies, and they're typically only rear facing and they attach to a base. You can remove the car seat, then add it to your stroller. However, today we're talking about convertible car seats. Yeah, and you wanna buy a convertible car seat because it is rear facing and forward facing and grows as your kid as they grow, can even turn into a booster. And a 360 rotating car seat is the same as a convertible car seat, still grows with your child. However, it's a little more convenient because it rotates. We've done our homework on these two popular car seats and we are gonna compare them based on price, weight limit, ease of installation, and size. Convertible car seats on average cost about $250 to $300. As for rotating seats, on average, they cost around $350 to $400. And that's because they rotate. So you're paying for convenience. So convertible car seats are big and rotating car seats tend to be even bigger. And this Kiko OneFit ClearTex all-in-one car seat is smaller than most convertible car seats, but it weighs about the same at 25 pounds. You can fit about two to three in the back seat of your car. Like I have an SUV, so I know I'm always looking for the one that can fit three. And with these cup holders, they move in, it's thinner, it goes a little bit taller, and also, cool thing, turns into a booster seat as well. So rotating car seats tend to be a little bit bigger. This one weighs 29 pounds, so you might be able to fit two, but you wanna check how big your car is and see what works for you. The nice part about this specific one, this Evenflow 360, it is a little shorter in length, so you will save some space this way while your baby's still rear facing. So there's a huge difference between these two car seat installations. With the rotating car seats, you only have to install once. You have your rear facing and your forward facing. You can take off the seat from the base and install with the seat belt or you can also install with the latch system. And with the convertible car seat, it's rear facing and forward facing as well, but you do have to install it two times for rear facing and forward facing. And you can install via belt path or latch. Most convertible car seats go from four to five pounds, which is the size of the average newborn, to up to 100 to 120 pounds because they turn into booster seats. And in forward-facing and rear-facing positions, there's also lots of different reclining positions here. So for most rotating car seats, you can start at four to five pounds. However, you can only go up to 60 to 65 pounds with these. This specific car seat, the Evenflow 360, you can use as a booster seat. So this one will last you up until about 100 pounds. As for the positions of this car seat, you can rotate and it also reclines in a few different ways. You can lift it up, recline it more, and then you can bring it back around for forward facing. So now let's talk about which one of these is actually best for you. I would say, you know, if you're a smaller person, you maybe only have one child right now, you're dealing with some back pain because it's hard, I would go with a rotating car seat for the convenience. And if money is a factor, or if you have a smaller car, or if you need to, you know, get multiples of these, I think the convertible car seat is probably best for you. Now for me personally, I would go with this specific rotating car seat, just because I love, I gotta show it one more time. <laughs> I love how little it is this way. My baby's still rear facing, I have a tiny car. This is perfect. This car seat is best for me. The convertible car seat is definitely best for me because I need to buy multiple of these and I need to have three of them soon that are gonna be you know, in the back seat of my car. All right, so we wanna know which one works best for you. Let us know down in the comments.